Hey there, today I'm going to show you how the new feature in Google Calendar called Appointment Slots works. So here we are looking at our calendar in Google and what I'm going to go ahead and do is click on a spot. I'm going to say, you know, Tuesday afternoons I would really like to let people go ahead and schedule time with me. This is great for consultants, uh, people who have service-based businesses, whether you're out and about or people come to see you. So I'm going to go ahead and click on a spot and now I have this option Appointment Slots, new. Great, I'm gonna go ahead and type in consulting time. And then I can select which calendar I want this to go on. And I'm gonna click appointment slots, there we go. And yes, I will offer 30 minute appointments, that sounds great. Let me go ahead and edit the details and make sure that I do from 12 to five in the afternoon. Great, and in this, case I'm going to say my location is by phone but it could be a physical location as well now in order for people to go ahead and schedule time with you you're gonna to want to give them this link now I know this link is not pretty but what you can do is turn it into a custom URL you could use bitly you could use a bunch of different URL shorteners to make that more convenient so I've now put that in there uh, I can even add guests so they could get notified every time someone makes a, an appointment request but we can see here you create the slot you share your link and then people make appointments. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit save. And we see there is my consulting time. So now let's go ahead and schedule some time. Now here we are in the view that your guest or your visitor would see when it comes to being able to schedule time. We can see the entire block as well as then we can go ahead and pick a time. So maybe this person would say, you know, I would really like to do one o'clock. Okay, so if this person knows what they wanna uh, talk about, they could even add something in to the consulting time and say, um, I have a question about um, my email and phone system. There we go. And yes, they can meet by phone. And then maybe they would say, please call me at this number. And I'll make it a 415 fictitious number. 5656. Five, six. Save. All right, and now your guest sees that uh, they have booked an appointment and they can go ahead and view it in their Google Calendar. All right, and now let's switch back over and see what it looks like. Now we can see that no time has been added to the calendar yet because we have to go ahead and accept it. So I'm gonna go over to my email, go to my inbox, and here it says invitation consulting time email and phone systems. And we see here uh, that the request uh, has been made and I actually was able just to make it to myself. And if you are comfortable and familiar with Google Calendar, then these items that come in your inbox, you're used to, but let's go ahead and just do it for folks who may not be aware. Um, here's our title, when, you know, from one to 1.30, it's gonna be by phone. And then yes, we could change it to maybe or no, but we'll say yes, we're going. We're going to that meeting. And now the neat thing is your Google Calendar event will show this item was created with an appointment slot. So that's pretty neat. Now, if we go back over and look at the actual calendar, then there we can see there is the appointment time and we're ready to go. Now, if we wanted to go ahead and maybe communicate with that person, if they were listed here, uh, we could go ahead and uh, send them a message and things like that. So that's pretty neat. That is how you go ahead and use the new feature in Google Calendar called Appointment Slots. Go ahead and enjoy it. I hope that you guys are able to definitely be more efficient and more effective with technology. Thanks.